What's up, YouTube? Strag Bus Dave. Uh, sitting here chilling Saturday morning. Got a really cool haul for you. Went and met up with a new friend of mine, really good friend. And uh, we got hooked up through a couple of guys I know from the flea market, a couple of red line collectors and stuff. And uh, he knows I've been picking up a bunch of red lines recently. And uh, I'm not going to open that jammer case because they'll fall out of both sides. So, But these cases I'll uh, open up, leave those for the, a background. I do have nine new red lines to share with you. Really high-end pieces, uh, mint condition. And uh, But anyway, so I went and met up with this uh, new friend of mine. He has an awesome collection. He's got some iron pieces. He has rainbows of almost every car. Uh, just He has some really nice stuff. And uh, it was a bit of a drive, but it was definitely worth it. And like I said, he's a good friend. And uh, this right here, I uh, saw that sitting over to the side. I said, dude, I do black walls too. He said, man, take that with you. I said, dude, are you sure? He gave it to me. So that's the kind of friend it is. A really good friend. And... Uh, the a lot of red lines I picked up. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and tell you, he did an amazing deal. Uh, some of these cars should be 50, 60, 70, 80 dollars a piece. Uh, when when he did the lot of nine cars, uh, it was around a couple hundred bucks. Um, you know, you can do the math. Around twenty dollars a car, something like that. Twenty-two dollars and uh, just a really fair good deal better than fair and uh, very appreciative I'm gonna go ahead and start off with the haul now and uh, no kind of order just gonna show them lined up down through here first we got an aqua woody in really amazing condition uh, it's the uh, textured roof it is an aqua and uh, it's very similar to the orange one that I got uh, off of Dread, Dreadnought. Thanks again, Dread, for the orange one. We did a little bit of uh, swapping around and whatnot. That was a while back, but this one is in aqua, so it goes good with the orange. And uh, textured roof, same as uh, the one I got from Dread. And uh, really nice piece, man. Really nice piece. Really good condition. Um, everything's just, you know, it's almost like a uh, blister pull. A lot of his stuff is that way. And a lot of the stuff he has opened, um, he's just got a really nice collection. Uh, picked out a green hairy hauler. This thing is uh, just gem mint too. It's, uh, you know, mini fresh. And uh, just really nice, man. Really cool piece. Um, I looked at one of these the other day online and it was... It's like 50 bucks or something, 40 bucks, buy it now. And uh, so I got a really good deal. Look, it, it's so new that the uh, top is staying in place. It flipped up. Uh, another cool thing about this piece, not only does the top flip up, look at that one. Usually they don't stay in place because they're worn out from wear. This one has uh, dually wheels in the back. Check that out. These wheels haven't even been rolled much. Really good condition pieces, uh, really quality stuff here. Uh, that one's the Harry Hauler. Uh, up next, we've got a Nomad, classic Nomad. This is a uh, awesome piece in aqua, and it does have some toning, but it is in uh, mint condition. And uh, you can see that there's well, I take that back. There is one spot right there on the driver door, but uh, other than that, yeah, it's got a little bit of toning. But awesome, awesome piece. Uh, up next, got a really nice piece. It's a hot pink whipped creamer. Uh, you know, I picked up a hot pink Mighty Maverick recently, uh, right there, and uh, that thing's really nice. Uh, well, this is a, a hot pink uh, whipped creamer. Nice condition, man, on this one too. Uh, it does have, uh, this has got like a corner edge down through there, and you did get some edge wear on this car. There's a chip right there, and then there's one other one right there. So, it's got two little chips. I mean, uh, you know, this is a car that I, I do believe books in excess of 100 bucks. So, uh, to, get them, to get it for what I got it for, uh, and it be, you know, near mint, almost perfect, uh, very happy to get that one. Up next, we've got a Demon, the Demon, uh, very famous Hot Wheels car. This was a show car back in the uh, late '60s, mid to late '60s, and uh, it was in the um, uh, Hot Wheels uh, TV series. If you watch, uh, if you go to Mike Zarnock's channel, he's got a um, 
the top Hot Wheels ever. It's uh, him, and uh, I can't think of the host's name right now, but it's a really cool episode. It's uh, on original Hot Wheels. I think most of them ended up being red lines, except for one, which was the um, Hot Bird. But yeah, this demon, uh, Dexter's Demons, I think was the name of the uh, dude on the... Um, on the TV show. Antifreeze is uh, the color on that one. And really like the antifreeze color. This is a mint piece too. Except for there's one dot. And that may have happened in. Uh, I mean it may have been in the blister that way. I don't know. Uh, also up next we've got a Aqua uh, Custom Volkswagen Beetle. This is a really cheery piece. Uh, I'll show you the difference in Hong Kong and U.S. here in just a minute. Um, see the holes in the base right there? And uh, like I said, this one's aqua. Uh, well, And this one's really cheery. My green U.S. piece right here, uh, I'll show you the difference. Uh, the base is going to be different. doesn't have the holes in the base. See? Um, also, it has two... Uh, posts. I'm not going to call them rivets. It's where they've rounded the post down. There's one and there's two. Uh, this is a U.S. piece and this one's not cherry like the aqua one I picked up today. I just wanted to show you as an example. On the Hong Kong you can see that they spun the back post down. There's a little bit of that aqua paint left on it and that happened a lot. But the front, the way, and it's got holes in the base, but the way they held the front in, it's the headlights. See that? Those headlights went in through the uh, body of the car, and that's on the Hong Kong piece. I've got another one like that, uh, the purple one right here. I'm not going to pull it out, but anyway, uh, you can see what I'm saying. Uh, there's aqua and there's purple. So I've got five different color bugs now with this new aqua one. I've got aqua, purple, green, red, and light brown or gold. Uh, it's hard to tell what that other color is. Uh, up next, but really glad to find that aqua uh, custom Volkswagen. It's one of my favorite, probably my favorite red line casting, uh, along with like uh, the Beach Bomb and the Woody, B Nick Bandit. Uh, up next, we've got an antifreeze J car for J car, and the cool thing about this one uh, is not that it's you know yeah it's in cheery condition, but uh, the really cool thing about it it's still got the black paint and the tail lights. The really cool thing about it is the tan interior. And we were looking in one of the new, it's called Elite uh, Red Lines, I think is the name of the new book. Uh, if you want a new uh, price guide, information guide, it's called Elite Hot Wheels or Elite Red Lines. And it's about a $30 book, but it's definitely worth it. Uh, my buddy had one. And on this J car for the tan interior, you add, uh, it said it books at 150%. So instead of being like a $45 car, it's probably about a $70 book value car. Uh, so that's the first seven cars uh, the Woody, the Harry Holler, the Nomad, the Pink Whip Creamer, the Demon, the Custom Volkswagen, and Aqua, and the uh, J car. Well, the last two that I'm saving for last are really, uh, man, they're major additions. Not that these that I've already shown you aren't major additions, but these two I'm about to show you just really uh, kind of blew me away that I found those. Um, one is the school bus. Everybody knows the school bus. Uh, it does have a couple of issues. So, you know, I can't say, oh, it's perfect. Um, it's missing. It should have a black sticker that would run up that edge right there. See, it's got a little bit of sticky on it um, under the word school bus. Well, it's missing that. And then up here on the top, it should have three stickers. That one, which is there. And then two on either side that would say 454 CI, which would be 454 cubic inch. There's a little bit of sticky there, so the stickers are gone. But if you overall look at that paint, yeah, the lights have got a little chip. But that paint is in really good condition, man. And try to find a really good paint condition school bus on uh, eBay or the Toy Peddler or whatever. And, you know, you're talking... 75 80 90 100 bucks or better and uh you know that i didn't pay that for half the entire lot so um just really thankful that my buddy hooked me up love this piece man it's got all its stuff it's got the prop it's a little flat a little bent to hold the hood up it's got the uh, 
blower right there. Uh, that's a really cool piece. And up last, you know I picked up this blue charger, custom charger recently. And yeah, it's got quite a bit of toning and stuff, but it's still a cool piece. Well, check this antifreeze custom charger out. This thing is just cherry, man. It's got little bits of uh, toning and the wheels are a little worn, but it's just a really nice condition piece, man. It's going to be a really nice addition. It's got something. Somebody had a sticker or something, right? Let me show you. Right there, see it's like a couple of little sticky dots, and uh, I'll probably take a Q-tip to that uh, later. But for now, it's uh, man, just a really good-looking antifreeze piece. And uh, if you look up antifreeze uh, uh, custom charger, it's a uh, it's a pretty hard to come by piece. So uh, let's see, what does it say on here? Custom Dodge Charger 1960. I think it says 68, but it actually would have been released second year. That's a second year car. Um, I'm really close to having uh, at least one, if not two, of uh, all the of a lot of the uh, second year cars, and I've got all but two of the uh, Sweet 16. I still need a decent custom Mustang, and I still need a decent custom Barracuda. So if anybody comes across a, a custom Mustang that they're willing to trade or sell or whatever, or a, a custom Barracuda, let me know. Send me a PM or something, and. Uh, you know, maybe I've got extras of something uh, that you, you know that you need. Um, if I do, let me know, and uh, maybe we can do something, or maybe you want to sell it. I don't know, or you know, I probably just find one online. But uh, it's always cool if you can uh, do some trading with a friend. So I hope everybody's having a good Saturday, good weekend, and I uh, hope you enjoyed checking out my nine new additions to the uh, Redline collection. We'll take one last look. Aqua Woody, uh, Apple Green, Harry Holler, Aqua Nomad with the hood still up, uh, Hot Pink Whip Creamer, Antifreeze Demon, Aqua Hong Kong Custom Volkswagen, uh, Antifreeze Ford J-Car, School bus, S come a cool, cool bus, school bus, and uh, antifreeze Dodge Charger. Well, everybody have a good one, and uh, I'll catch you later. Peace.